Hello boys and girls and teachers. My name is Mr. Fox and I work for Northampton Town FC Community Trust just up there. I'm here to talk to you and have a nice assembly today regarding something called Planet Super League. Something very exciting that is going to be happening across the county and also across the country over the next few months starting on March the 27th. I'm going to share lots of information today about the program, how it works and how you can get involved, earn points, earn prizes, win different things throughout the program. And then at the end, I'm sure you'll know enough to explain it back to your teachers and tell your parents as well. So I'm going to share you my presentation about today's assembly about Planet Super League. I really hope that you enjoy. Here we go. So here it is, Planet Super League. It is our second time at doing this program. We ran it before Christmas where we were out working with certain parents and it's a program for you and your parents and your brothers and sisters to have a go at and get involved with at home. Okay. So just before we get started, if I was with you in school today, I would be asking you to do some different things. So as we are still in school where you're watching this from, I would just like everyone to have a quick stand up and do a bit of walking on the spot because we are very much about physical activity. In fact, I'll do a little bit with you now so you can see Mr. Fox involved alongside you all. Okay, we want to get the heart beating a little bit faster and we also want to get our brains engaged because physical activity turns on those neuron pathways for you at school. So I want you to have a little think about the sports you did last week and then I want your teachers to ask you and tell me some different sports that you've been involved with, not the same sports like football, because I'm sure you like lots of different sports. How many of you did one sport this week? Give your teacher a wave. If you did two sports this week, give your teachers a wave. How many sports did you do? Put your hands up and share, please, with your teachers. We're always interested to know what physical activity you are getting up to in school, but also outside of school. And that might be with your parents or your friends or whoever else you can do it with at the moment. Okay, great stuff. Now we've had a chance to engage a little bit of physical activity there and engage our brains. Here we go. What is Planet Super League? So Planet Super League is where football joins the fight against climate change with the fans and anyone who enjoys any engagement of physical activ activity in the outdoors and you can compete to help save the planet for us. And as I said, we got involved in this before Christmas and was fourth in the league in saving the planet. Here's two of our friends and our family from Northampton Town Community Trust that helped us last time. So what did we do last time? Well, we used the power of football to inspire families to take on climate change. Some of you might know, not know what climate change is. So if you want to pause the assembly right now and teachers want to ask their children if they can give you a lovely answer about what climate change might be, that would be fantastic. If you're back with me, great. Before Christmas, as I said, we were involved with 10 of the clubs and our parents did brilliantly. They were awesome. And because of that, we were able to give out prizes such as one of our mascot, Clarence the Dragon, little teddies. We also gave out medals. We gave out footballs. We gave out shirts. We gave out certificates. Lots of different prizes came their way. And we're looking to do exactly the same, but bigger and better. Last time, there were 220 parent signups involved in Planet Super League. And over 4,000 activities was completed by families across the country during a six-week period. This week, it will take place for 11 weeks and slightly different, which we will come on to shortly. 77% took their car out less than normal. Now, that is one of the challenges that we try and set you not to be in your car as much and travel different ways around the county, but also to school. 63% spent more time out in nature, where one of the tasks is to go and take a picture of bugs. One of the tasks is to go for a walk with your family, do a 2K run, 5K run. There are lots of different things that you can do with nature as part of the 60 new tasks that they have got ready to launch. Okay, I'm going to show you a quick video now about what West Bromwich Albion did in terms of their inspiring the planet as part of Planet Super League. 
We've set up Planet Super League to inspire people to take action on climate change. There are some huge targets set to move towards a low carbon economy. And we just thought, could we use the power of football to try and get people more interested in sustainability? We're down at Moreland's Primary School today, and this is with West Brom Foundation. This is one of the schools who are taking part in Planet Super League and our partnership with West Brom. Planet Super League's worked really well with our social action. Children have been learning about different ways that they can kind of be greener and be more sustainable both in school and at home. We have been uh, making things to make, the, to make the planet greener. I think it's really important that they learn about the impacts of climate change because they're, they're going to be the, our next generation. They're making some, uh, making some characters and equipment out of recyclable materials today um, just for a bit of fun to get a bit of project work going. I think it's a great idea. I think if, you know, competition in every, anything is a, is a really good way to get people engaged. It's also meant that some of our quieter children, by using the Planet Super League, it's made them sort of come out of their shell a little bit more and express their opinions that maybe we wouldn't have seen. Um, so football brings them on board, gets them interested, and then they kind of see the importance of it through the education. Um, and the, the competitive and the football element of it just drives them to compete. It's fun because you try new things and you learn new stuff. And then I won a quiz. Oh, wow. What did you win? Uh, a £10 West Brom gift card. Fantastic. And the children that experienced it uh, in our year sixes absolutely loved going to those sessions and couldn't wait for their Friday afternoons uh, where they got to go and see what their next challenge was going to be. The, the whole point of the programme really is about engaging the kids to take action and kind of take action away from when we're working with them. So they're going to be going home, working with their families and friends and encouraging each other to you know, take these small steps that will make a big difference to the environment. Well, at home I've been doing like I've been I had a I had a screen free day. I had a meat free night. I, I made binoculars and I did scarecrow as well. Next year we'll be launching Planet Super League across the UK, talking to more and more clubs and ultimately more and more families. Um, I think it's an important cause. Um, and I think if you can educate them from a young age, you know, we can all do our bit. And I think moving forward, that's only a positive thing. It's got me thinking about we shouldn't use that much things because it's not good for the environment and we should do more things to save it. OK, boys and girls, so awesome little video there from West Brom. We did our own things with some of our own staff as well that went down very positively. Um, here are some of the other activities that were involved during Planet Super League 1, some of the different tasks. So our friends here at Northampton, the family here was building, as you saw in the video, a goalkeeper that they made and was taking shots. They also did goal celebrations, which were then recorded and then he uploaded them. People taking pictures of bugs. And here, this is a... Uh, a cake, a vegan based cake, I think, with Jim Jam chocolate. Look at those football goals on there and sweets as swirly snakes by the looks of them for goalposts. So, lots of different ideas of lots of different things that you can do. So, we need you now again as it launches on the 27th of March. This time, no longer is there 20 clubs, there is now 24 clubs, and we are hoping to engage 2,000 families in the project. It no longer runs for nine weeks. It's now 11 weeks because of the 24 clubs. And we are in a league with 11 other teams. Okay. Each week, we will now progress to verse a team each week. Rather than a cu cumulative amount of points that we gain, each week we are against another club where we need to try and win points to try and win that match. Letters have been sent out to your schools already, to you and via your channels, but we'd like to you to engage and talk to your parents more about signing up now that you've seen some of the different things that you can do. 60 activities, as I said, on the website and on the app. And all you do is send your pictures in of the activities that you complete at home to get points, 10 points, 50 points, etc. And you get weekly fixtures against a different team, as we said. Prizes will come out from Planet Super League, such as Amazon vouchers, Social Media Player of the Year, Family of the Year, uh, the Milner Award. Various different awards will come out from them, and they were given out Amazon vouchers, club vouchers. As I said, we will be giving out lots of prizes on a weekly basis for you and your families for the pairs, the most points for a family who helped us that particular week, the continuous most points. 
there's extra special award, different challenges that we will give prizes for. Okay. If you've got any questions, you can send them into us, but you can also talk to your teachers, but that should give you a big array of what to do. More information is found on the website at psl.football, which is where you sign up with your families, which you'll also see on both this letter, which is a poster, and also this letter, which will have been sent home already electronically, and we can get that back out to you again if you need more copies. Okay, I hope you enjoyed the presentation. We need you guys because we want to help win the league and we want to help the environment by doing these fun, engaging activities to save the planet as well. I'm sure you're excited to get on board and you will help us with this. Thank you very much for listening to me at the Community Trust and I hope to see you soon.